Good morning, everyone. Day two of EJS. So we are holding Sunday the 10th um, here in Moab. We are doing Moab Rim today. We kind of got a late start. We decided to join uh, a group of our friends that are here from Off-Road Toys with Waldy's um, Off-Road, which is another YouTube channel. Um, they're all the way here. I mean, they're here from all different parts, Texas, Georgia, Philadelphia, um, a whole bunch of different. I think we are to say like 30 rigs or something crazy like that so it's gonna be a long day uh patience is the key um but yeah i definitely moab has been something else <laughs> waiting here guys for my turn for the next obstacle moab yesterday we did hell's revenge for the first time or any wheeling in uh, moab for that matter uh we did it with bleeping jeep so make sure you follow them on all social media super cool guys bleeping jeep and bleeping colt um they took us out there and um traction out here is crazy so i mean you have traction on all terrains everything has traction so that's a little different i am used to giving it some gas um because out on the east coast everything's wet right so we have um and then everything's like in a forest so it doesn't really ever dry out aop and windrock are always moist um, that being said, the wheeling out here is very different. It's beautiful scenery, super red, different types of rocks and shrubbery, cacti all over the place, which is cool. Um, I'm not used to the like 10,000 feet drop to your death kind of thing. And then you're also off camber to that edge. Um, I don't like it. It makes my stomach feel weird. So I'm trying to get over the fear of that, but we'll see how that goes.
Dale para atrás. Dale para atrás. Dale pasajero. Adelante pasajero. Pasajero. Dale, dale. Dale, dale, dale. Mira, pump it. Pump, pump. Bump it, dale. Bump it, driver. Así está bien, dale.
late. I think it's, let's check the time, 4.46, and we're on our way down Moab Rim, so it's kind of a loop. So the same way we came up, we have to come down, and I think it gets a little bit sketchy going down, so I am waiting my turn in line for the obstacle. But all in all, it's been a great day. We had an amazing time with friends. I'm so happy that we um, chanced upon them at the gas station, so this was really fate. Um, I had a great time. The views were spectacular. If you guys haven't been out here, definitely recommend. I think it's rated a seven as far as difficulty, which I don't, I didn't really think it was a seven. I think Hell's Revenge was rated on the Jeep Batch of Honor um, app as a three to six. And I think this was, um, I think Hell's Revenge was a lot more difficult than Moab Rim, um, but that's just me. guys noticed the clear lid so honestly I don't know how you could do Moab any other way the clear lids um, for JK for JL just get the right one lets me see all of the rocks and like everything that my regular freedom panels would not allow me to so this has been an awesome experience honestly I'm still wearing a jacket so the Moab Sun is not wrecking me I don't feel any more heat than you would through um, your normal freedom panels so definitely disproving that myth um, it's been debunked it is not any hotter I would say than regular freedom panels Look at these beasts. So I'm waiting for my turn to go, but it looks like there is a traffic jam. So here we are. Thank <laughs> you. 
buena. Así mismo, dale un toquecito, dale un toque. Buena, buena. We made Moab Brim. It was awesome. The views were like no other. We had an amazing time with our friends at Off-Road Toys out in Atlanta and our friends out in Puerto Rico, Waldy's Off-Road. So if you haven't already subscribed to their channels on all social media, go ahead and do so and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.